the Vivekananda, the emotional, intelligent leader, the philosopher. So what happens then in this can create an even more stressful environment where workers are always working on excess, trying to prevent the next outburst from happening from the leader. This often has disastrous effects on productivity and team cohesion because the employees stay too distracted by this fear to focus on work and bond. So, so what happens? How do you raise the emotional intelligence? There are five ways. Increase your leadership ability. And increase leadership ability, what we call soft skills. And the soft skills which I will very soon take you in that how Bhagavad Gita has explained to understand the increasing of emotional intelligence in leaders. Second is increase team performance. improve a decision making process decrease occupational stress reduce staff turnover and increase personal well-being so left side First three is look at the individual human, how you can improve. And the right side, too important, decrease occupational stress, reduce staff turnover, and then increase personal well being. That means my personal health. So these are five effective ways and you can increase your emotional leadership in your life. Now, I love this one. That how Bhagavad Gita talks about emotional intelligence in leadership. The Bhagavad Gita, chapter 2, verses 15, it says, Yam Hina Bathayantyat Purushan Purushasat Sama Dukha Sukham Dhira So Amrita Daya Kalpade whom verily not distress these person, the noblest amongst men. Now, what does this mean? Krishna is telling Arjun, the noblest amongst men, that person who is not affected by happiness and distress and remains steady in both becomes eligible for liberation. Now, we all read or have read Bhagavad Gita. Sometimes two times a day, sometimes three times a day. Why? Because you want to practice religion. Read and keep it nicely in our home. But we tend to forget to practice what we read in Bhagavad Gita. I look at Bhagavad Gita as a perfect example 
of leadership training book perfect example of entrepreneurship book perfect example of how to enhance emotional intelligence in leadership so what this particular verse says that we got to understand as i said earlier good news and bad news how do you evaluate good news how do you evaluate bad news in the materialistic world when you receive good news happiness that is a profit we are very happy but in the business when we lose we are sad and we are sad mental stress no more self regulation no more self awareness no more empathy no more motivation so question is why does not a material happiness satisfy us so gita is telling us when you read we got to understand that the happiness what we saw just now sama dukha sukham sama dukha sukham that we have to be equalized we have to be balanced when we have distress and when we have happiness that that's the quality of emotional intelligence in leadership so what is saying sama dukha sukham dhiram so amrita tatayo kalpate so becomes eligible become content now the emotional leader what happens they for them is people oriented for them people around to take care i'll give you a classic example of my student who has become now perfect leader one of his staff always working very hard stay back in the office until 10 o'clock at night and come in the morning so one day this particular staff went and saw my student who is a leader of the organization said sir today i want to go back home at 4 o'clock in the afternoon and my student who is the leader he told him sure please go charanti thati the leader my student he went to his employee's room and saw that particular student that particular employee still engaged in the morning when that particular employee told him that he want to go back early so my student asked him why you want to go back he said my wife wants to take our daughter to the shopping mall he said okay so 3:30 the boss went to his employee's room and saw the employee was very busy in work so that particular boss left the office went to their room their house and told the wife and the daughter let's go to the shopping mall and your husband will come to the shopping mall so three of them went to shopping mall spend